I am Turi Madagwa. In this short video, I want to talk about how to send unlimited emails using your phone. Actually, we are going to use our Android phone to send this unlimited email. You can actually use it with your iOS and all that. But in our next video, I'm going to do that. Sending bulk emails from your iPhone or any iOS device like iPad and the rest. So in this video, we will do sending from our Android phone. Okay. All you need to do is to go to your Play Store and search for this app, MailDroid. Once you search on it, you install it on your phone. Once you install it on your phone, you add the SNTP details that you copy your emails and you start sending. It's that easy. You can do it on the go or probably if you don't have a laptop or probably you're always on the go or you like working from your phone like me. I do like to work on my phone at all times. So you can use this video. You can use the tips in this video to send it. So the only thing you need to do is to get SMTP. So you can get our SMTP server where you generate unlimited of this SMTP that you use with this app to send and all that. Let's get into our PC and see practical demonstration on how to send unlimited emails using your phone. Okay. Okay. The very first thing we'll do now, once you get on your phone, I'm actually using Android, so I'll just go to Google Play Store and um, search for the app. It is actually called Mail Droid. Okay, Mail Droid D. So I can say okay, Mail Droid. So you've seen it because I've already installed it, so that's why it's like this. So you just like. If you don't have it on your phone, you just click here. Here you see install instead of update. Okay. So once you install it, you just like open it. Okay. So this is the app that we'll be using. Okay. So already I have it. I have one already that I've been using. So all I need to do now is just to add my new SMTP. You can add multiple and the rest. Okay. So let me click here now and I'll click on this dot, click on manage the account. Then the next thing I'll do is just to click on add. Okay. So those are free and all that. But we'll go to order and um, type your SMTP username. So I'm going to put my, which is story um, at um, pauljumbo.com. So I'm going to type my password here. Okay, I've typed my password. The next thing I'll do is I'll just click on manual setup. Then I'll choose IMAP. Okay, so it has picked my details. It has brought my server information and all that. Okay, so the next thing I'll do here is just to enter my server name, which is mail.pauljumbo.com. Then I'm going to click on secured. So yeah, I'm going to change this, my port address. All this comes with my SMTP details. I'll just click on first is five. Okay. So the next thing I'll do here, I'll just click on next to validate it. Now, when you get our server, we'll would show you how you create this SMTP, how you get all these details. So you can see now that it has been added. Okay. So you can see now I have two SMTP here that um, I can use to send unlimited emails and the rest. So it's better you send it little by little. So for instance, now in my mail account I'm using on my phone, I'm using to send bulk email for my business. I have over 20 of these SMTPs different. So what I do is I'll just use this one. I send 500, this one send 500. So you can send as high as 50,000 at once using different SMTP instead of you using just one that we go to spam okay so i'll just click here then i'll go back here now okay so you can see here so from here now i can start sending my email so before that let me also talk about this app it's very important you install it on your phone or probably you use another one so for instance what this app uses to store information and all that so in this app you can just store your informations like the emails you want to send and all that okay this is my server informations and the rest so let's say i want to send mail now to those emails i'll just copy them 
from your desktop and put it in Evernote, okay? So once you put it in Evernote, you just come here since you are doing your phone. Instead of you typing it one by one and the rest, okay? So let me just highlight it. Okay, so I'm good. I'll just copy it now from my Evernote. Then I'll go back to MailDroid, okay? So now I'll just click on this button. It, it simply means compose, okay? To who, whom am I sending it to? Let's say I'm sending it to mail at um, mail at Paul Jumbo. Mail at pauljumbo.com. Okay, subject. Just um, trying, trying SMTP. Okay. So this is where you put the title of your email. So this is where you put your content, trying SMTP, whatever, anything you want to put. So that's why the Evernote is very important. You just copy it, copy and paste and paste it here. Okay. So because I don't want it to be too long, we are just testing. So you can do send from Midroid or you can delete this if you like. Okay. Or you put your address and all that. Okay. So when you get to our server, we'll explain all this, how it makes your email goes to inbox and all that and authenticity and the rest. Okay. So this is like that. So I'll go here and I'll click here. Then I'll click here on BCC. Okay. So this is where I'll now paste those email that I copied. Okay. So to Madago, I think this email it's not it's not okay. Okay, I didn't copy it too well. Okay, so manually you can just keep adding and all that. So you can do as high as 200 and the rest. Okay, so if in case maybe I want to add more and more, I can just do jokes and um, keep adding and like that. Okay, so once you are true with it, all I'll do here now is just to click here on send. Okay, so it's going to send it. Usually it takes some few seconds. It will schedule it. Okay, so now I have actually sent this email new message count so I've sent it okay so it has gone you can also read your emails too from here when you get reply and the rest so now if I want to send another one now I can now come here now also and click here now you know the first one I did was good at Paul Jumbo so I can now change the account and then probably use Turi or probably use good so if you have over 100 SMTPs that's how you'll be sending it on the go so from your phone and all that, okay? So I can always go to my email and um, check to see if it's an in inbox and the rest, okay? <clears throat> so you can see that it's an in inbox. So you see, it's, so the rest now, if I go to my PC and check, you see all of them have actually gone to inbox. This is one of them. So let me check the second one too. The second one too also goes to inbox too. The Outlook and the rest, any others, they always go to inbox most time that I do them. So this is how you use MailDroid to send unlimited bulk emails from your phone. So the most important things you need, it's a server that you use to generate those unlimited SMTP. Then some little server settings that you do before you use this. This particular email that I use for this demo, they are not configured to send bulk emails. These are just my private email. I used on my domain pauljumbo.com. They are not configured for bulk email, but I just use it to try the software and all that. Okay, so when you get our server, we'll now show you proper how you generate this SMTP and send. Okay. Thank you for watching this video up to this part. Now, like as I said, it's very important for you to get our guide on how you generate this SMTP. You can use it on your phone. You can use it to create web mail. You can use it for PHP mailer. You can use it to do any other thing. Now, most times why your emails goes to spam is because you are using one SMTP to send so much. So it's better for you to generate this SMTP 
and um, you use them to send in piecemeal. So what do I mean is that, for instance, if you generate 10 SMTP and each is sending 500, so you can do 5,000 emails per hour and they will go to inbox. The inbox rate is usually 90 to 95%. So I would advise you to get our server. All you need to do is to go to pauljumbostore.com slash server, then you'll see it, then you can get it. Now, thank you for watching this video. Please kindly subscribe to our channel. Click on the subscribe link below. Then also comment if there is any other thing you want to know or another video you like us to do and the rest. Thank you for watching.